Okay. I think I now know what I'm supposed to do. And I, what I'm supposed to do... And then... Is be... Is to present him with the memo. The me... Maya... <sighs> Conversation I had with my sister was recorded on my cell phone. Present him with this. Did you see my face cell phone? Oh, that? I have that. Did you think I could... Do you think I can give it back? You can give it back? Sure! I, I mean... Wait a second, pal! Tricky lawyer! Uh-oh. Anyway. Just tell them straight. Why I want it, there's no way he'll give it to me. Oh, no, just, you know, detective. Nope, I know nothing, pal. Cell phone has a lot of numbers on it, like her boyfriend's. Cell phone holds all the girl's sweetest and spiciest secrets. You're trying to confuse me? Sorry, pal, I already checked all numbers in memory. Impressive. You're quite that detective. Uh-huh. You here, you can... Uh-huh. Oh, here, you can have a phone back. There weren't any suspicious call records in there after all. Seems it didn't notice the recorded conversation. Court records here, recorded conversation. I guess I've asked all the questions I need to. All done, pal. Um, yes, thank you. I'll be heading out now. Oh, wait. One more thing I wanted to mention to you. I don't suppose you're planning on talking to that witness. Anyway, you better not. No influencing witnesses with your lawyer or anybody's pal. I don't think that I had completely forgotten about her. The witness? Yeah, it's April May. Sorry about this. But I can't tell you anything about her. Well, you just told me her name. It's May, huh? So you've sent her home already, then? <laughs> You're trying your lawyer tricks on me now! It's not... She's not to go outside her room until the trial. So she's still in a hotel across the way. Guess I should know better than trying to get a detective to link information. You got that right, pal. Pay a visit to Miss May! Okay, that means now I am able to head to the Gatewater Hotel. September 6th, Gatewater Hotel, room 303. Well, hello there, handsome. Um, hi. Smooth, right? Real smooth. You're the lawyer, aren't you? The detective told me. You said, don't say anything to that lawyer, pal. Hehe. <laughs> Memo cell. Thank Detective Gumshoe for making my job harder. Gee, this is all like something out of a movie. It's all so exciting, I can hardly contain myself. Oh, let me go freshen up so I can look the part of the beautiful eyewitness. I pity the lawyer that has to cross-examine this one. Uh, what the hell is that? Screwdriver stuck in the drawer? I wonder what's inside. Let's look. Hey! What are you doing? No touching! Oh, bad boy! You really shouldn't pry around in other people's rooms now. You, sh you wouldn't want to make me upset, would you? Upset? I thought she was going to explode for a second there. I wonder what she could be hiding inside the drawer. Let's talk. What do you witnessed? Do you think you could tell me something? I need you to describe what you observed at the time of the incident. Oh? Observe? Incident? Oh, you sound like a lawyer in the movies. I like a man with a big vocabulary. Hmm. Better not encourage her. Uh, 
you know that thing that occurred happened the other day. Bad thing. Well, do well, did you see when it happened? I don't suppose you could tell me about that, pretty please. Let me see. Um, well, dream on. If you wanna know, you'll we'll just have to come to the court tomorrow, Mr. Lawyer. Oh boy. Um, could you just who exactly are you? Oh, Mr. Lawyer, are you hitting on me? N -n 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 no hey! I'm just doing my job here. <laughs> you know you're cute when you blush. Believe me, this is the first time in my life I've blushed this much. Um. <laughs> right. Can you just tell me what it is you do? Well, no. <laughs> and you had your little hopes up, didn't you? So there are two glasses on the table. Is there someone staying with you? Oh, what amazing powers of observation. You must be one of those famous detectives like on television. Oh, no, not me. I'm uh, just a lawyer. Say, Mr. Big Detective, why don't you look for clues in the garbage? Hmm? This man doesn't like noisy little lawyers. <laughs> oh, okay. Well... to Grosberg to see if he's there now. Still out. Maybe I should just wait here for him to come back. Ahem! If that wasn't the most over-the-top clearing of the throat I've ever heard. Aha! So you're the one they say has been looking for me. Uh, d yes, that's me. He looks even grander than I imagined. Huh? The badge on your collar! Ah, so you're a lawyer, are you now? Uh, yes. Well, yes. And what do you want? I'm not particularly busy these days. Please proceed. Not busy? How come no one could get in touch with you? Hmm? Something the matter? You came to see the one and only Marvin Grosberg, did you not? <coughs> oh, Christ. Oh. Well, here I am, boy. What do you want? Out with it! Um, well, sir, actually, it's about Maya. Maya Fay. Hmm? Ah, uh, yes, Maya Fay. Go on. Why the strange reaction? Uh, ch ch I'm really quite busy here, son. Uh, can't go talking cases on day's notice. No, not qu it's quite impossible. Wait a second. How did you know the trial's tomorrow? <clears throat> Ahem. Yeah, anyway, yeah, I'm afraid the entire impossibly for me to represent her. Sorry, end of discussion. What's going on? He refused me before I even got a chance to ask him. What do I tell me, am I? I almost did it again. How can you just refuse like that? Please tell me why you won't take the case. Um, well, um, well, you see, I'm just, I'm busy, you see. But the client is Mayfay's sister. Oh wait, but the client's Mayfay's sister. <clears throat> Well, May trusted you. She knew her sister wouldn't be in good ha be in good hands. Oh, fuck now. I keep forgetting to read the name to know which voice to use. Fuck. <sighs> she trusted you. Yes, yes, of course I knew that. However, I'm sorry, but I must refuse. Sorry, goodbye. Creep. Fine. I don't have any time to argue with you anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Flemmy. I'll go look elsewhere. <clears throat> Think not. Huh? She 
you say something? I think not, I said. What do you mean? I'm terribly, terribly sorry. But I'm afraid that no lawyer with their salt will take on this particular case. Terribly sorry, my boy. Why? 